Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video, we're gonna be talking about how cells poop. Each and every cell in our body poops, produces waste products. And in this video, we're gonna talk about how that happens, how that is removed out of the body, and ways we can help support that natural process so that we get poop out of the body more efficiently. So every cell in the body produces metabolic waste products or cellular poop. The cells in the body, over trillions of them, produce this poop and it ha on a daily basis, continuous basis, that then needs to be processed and eliminated out of the body. Think about all the tons and tons of poop that each cell is producing and how the body in its intelligence is processing all of that on a daily, daily basis. So when you think about cellular poop or metabolic waste, we're talking about hormone and, and neurotransmitter byproducts. We're talking about ammonia, CO2, urea, uric acid, and creatinine. All of these are acidic byproducts that then, once they start leaving the cells, are produced in an acidic environment. So making sure that we're eliminating this properly and getting out of the body quickly and efficiently is really key to making sure that we're living in a healthy environment and that the cells aren't overwhelmed with too much acidity or toxicity around them. You think of it like the same, the same process in a city, in New York City, we have garbage that uh, we put out on our, on our sidewalks and if that is not collected it, it, it gets to pile up it produces smells it just creates a, a really bad external environment so we want to make sure that, that we have an efficient garbage disposal removal system and luckily the body has that very very efficient process in place so the main area that the cells excrete into is called the extracellular matrix it's the space in between the cells and our blood vessels and so this space is also where the immune system lives. It's filled with fibrous collagen proteins. It's the nervous system touches this, this part of the, of the body. Fat cells live in this space. It's a very active uh, part of the body that extends and it touches every single cell in our body. So the space itself, you can see here circled uh, in yellow, really surrounds and envelops our, our body and it's the you can think of it as a sidewalk if you're going to think of the house as a cell in this big city the extra matrix is the sidewalk it's the space where we the cells of our bodies dump all this metabolic waste and then get processed and how does it get removed from that initial metabolic waste space or that extra matrix space is by the lymphatic system the lymphatic system then is like a garbage collection super highway it collects all this waste that gets being dumped from the cells it sucks it up into lymphatic circulation. So your lymphatic system then has vessels that take this garbage, suck it up, and collect it from every single cell in the body that then get dumped into lymphatic circulation, lymphatic fluid, that then gets pumped into directly into our blood circulation where the heart pumps it into the liver and kidney for processing. So you can think of the flow of this garbage as the cells excrete into the extracellular matrix. The extra matrix collects the space it collects this garbage in this space and the lymphatic system then draws out all this garbage through the lymphatic circulation that gets dumped into regular blood circulation. The heart then pumps this into the liver for processing, into the kidneys for processing, out of the kidneys in, as urine and out through bile and through the stool by the gut, through the liver pathway. So we have two main pathways we're eliminated. The skin uh, through sweating also is another way we can get rid of this, get rid of this uh, waste products. But for the majority of the day, for the vast majority of the waste disposal process, it is the uh, liver and kidneys processing via urine and stool. Gas exchange via CO2 happens via the lungs. So one of the ways I love supporting this process, this natural detox process, is by using drainage remedies. Drainage remedies are complex combination herbal and homeopathic products that specifically support those main organs that are in charge of removing this garbage from our body. That includes the liver, the kidneys, lymphatic system, gut, and we can also help support the extracellular matrix space. One of the companies I love is a company from Italy called Guna, which makes remedies for these major compartments of the body. We take it in liquid drop dose in a little bit of water every day, twice a day, and this helps to heal, support, and give, give blood flow and energy support to these main organs of elimination so that we can remove toxicity, remove the toxic burden in the body in a very efficient and effective way. If you'd like to learn more about ways to support our natural body's ability to detoxify, I have a free PDF guide, link in bio, where I, where I share different ways we can support 
our body's natural ability to eliminate the different ways we can support the gut, the kidneys, the liver, lymphatic system, and overall the process of waste disposal elimination of the body. And I shared that in that free guide, so you can click that in the link in the bio. And I will see you on the next video.